Hi, hello, it's been six months since I've made any update video, and I have some things I need to talk about, so I'll try to be concise. Today marks one year since I uploaded Copper. I stopped uploading in my disgusting Series 1 format and started caring about visuals. Since I made the switch, some people have said I focus too much on video making and that I should care less about the visuals that accompany my Series 2 songs, but I'm not spontaneously uploading to talk about Series 2, I'm here to talk about Series 1. For the longest time, I uploaded in this horrid format, and I was aware of how bad it was from the very start. I felt strangely obligated to stick with it, and I'm not sure why, but I'm past that. I technically never announced Series 1 ending and Series 2 beginning, and I'm not sure if I've even mentioned it verbally on my channel. I'm sure most of you remember Series 1. Statistically, two-thirds of my subscribers came from my time under Series 1. Series 1 includes a lot of songs, good ones, bad ones, lots of bad ones, and now that I upload all my music after Series 1 to Spotify, iTunes, and plenty other platforms, it only made sense to put all the highlights from Series 1 onto an album and distribute it through those platforms. I selected 30 songs myself that I'm most happy with. It was unfair to leave them in with all the other garbage in Series 1. A week ago, I uploaded all 30 of those songs through my distributor, and the album should be online on all platforms by now. It's called Emerge. In addition to announcing the album, I want to take some time in this little video to talk about copyright. I've generally avoided talking about it for the most part, but I need to mention it. Copyright is serious, and people really should pay more respect to it as a whole. I want to make it clear, my music is under Creative Commons with attribution. Series 2 uploads say that you need to contact me, which is no longer true, I just haven't gotten the time to change all 40 YouTube descriptions yet, and the Series 1 uploads don't even make any reference to copyright information. So yes, music is under Creative Commons with attribution, you can use it in your own work, Works as long as I'm credited somewhere. Just a link to my channel or website or whatever will be enough. While we're in the mood for celebrating Series 1, I'd like to point out all the visual flaws in each and every one of my Series 1 uploads. The base images are actually 1149 by 649, which causes issues when scaling to 1080. The base images weren't even 16 by 9, but the video was exported in 16 by 9. The ending credits image, which just displayed my name, is 7 seconds, which leaves an uncomfortable silence at the end of viewing a song on YouTube. 7 seconds was chosen arbitrarily because that's the default length of an image when dragged into Movie Maker. My name on the ending credits image was painfully crooked. The thickness of the letters varied a little because the text was hand-drawn. The height of the letters varied a lot because I never set myself a standard. I used Movie Maker's default export settings, which has a horrible visual quality, even though it says it exports in 1080p. One of the artifacts of using Movie Maker, even when rendering in maximum quality, is these uncomfortable black edges. New actual music will be coming soon. I'm very proud of this upcoming album. Follow my Twitter for updates on my life and music and other things, join my Discord if you want to talk to me or others, follow my Instagram for cursed cube images, thanks for sticking with me, enjoy the album, see you in like two and a half weeks with new songs, sorry this video was long, bye.